our play of the week comes from the Astros' George Springer, who executes a diving catch and right to rob Miguel Cabrera of a hit. Springer doesn't react to the ball until it's more than a full second into its flight. This is because when the three inch ball comes off the bat, it's more than a football field away and beyond Springer's acuity limit to determine depth. In fact, because the ball is hit directly at him, from Springer's vantage point, it mirrors the trajectory of a ball, hit up to 50 feet farther or shorter for about the first 90 feet of its flight. To make up for this lost in reaction time, Springer cranks it up to more than 20 miles per hour in less than three seconds. That's an acceleration on par with NFL speedster and sports science alum, Cordero Patterson. When he catches the ball, Springer launches his body completely parallel to the ground as he stretches about eight feet. After the catch, Springer could potentially land with more than a half ton of force. To minimize impact force, Springer converts his downward momentum into angular momentum by rolling as he contacts the ground. This softens Springer's impact enough for him to hang onto the ball and grab our play of the week. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.